an, it's an incredible story about a brother, one brother who's the biggest gangster in the East Coast, and his, his brother is the probably the most popular politician in the state of Massachusetts, and their childhood best friend is the special agent John Connolly of the FBI. So it's just too crazy. You couldn't make something like that up. This is a very American story. It's a very uh, particular milieu of American life as well, in a very particular place, Boston, which is a really unique part of Northeastern America. And um, it's just the most extraordinary story to play the other half of this fraternal relationship, one half of my half of the sort of democratic political side that you know, uses words and charm to you know, leverage currency and gain political power. And then, you know, his currency is all about. Is all about violence, and yet we, we sit down at the family table. We have the same mother, we're from the same blood, so it's kind of extraordinary. For a film director, it's an embarrassment of riches because these are some of the best actors working in cinema today. For them to come in and play large or small parts was really heartening and gratifying. There's a huge responsibility, no matter who you know uh, that person is. And, and with, with uh, Jimmy Bolger, you know, it's. It was really a question of, you know, what, what is the approach into that man? And, and I felt that the most um, pure approach was to, to approach him as a, as, as a man. Because he's a real character, you don't want to glamorize, you know, or sort of glamorize the violence or, or what's happening in the movie. So, so you know, if we tried to show it in as kind of an unflinching manner as possible. Johnny's remarkable. He's a national treasure in America, the man who transforms for every part of his, his physical and his psychological and his emotional transformation were so vast. And who he really is the person that it, as the film's director and as a fan, it was a really remarkable experience. He's uh, an amazing actor. He's uh, we, we say he's like a treasure and uh, you know, he, he does a he does a, a physical transformation, but as Scott likes to say, our director, that the, the, the real transformation is this interior one that really inhabits the role of white culture. This really isn't uh, so much a gangster picture, it's a humanistic look at uh, a group of criminals, and not so much about criminals who happen to be humans.